Choose it. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. My name is Brother Lawrence Onyeka. I reside at Aba. And uh, I joined Choose It 2012, December. I worship at the uh, Obingwa Autonomous over here. I want to thank God for making me a chosen. Thank you, Father. Thank you, God, your chosen. I still want to thank this God of chosen who has break the yoke of female, female children in my family. Mm. Thank you, Father. Thank you, God, your chosen. It happened like this. I, as a first son, I have eight brothers and sisters. We are eight in number. Three brothers uh, and uh, five sisters. And seven among us married. I married and I give birth to female children. Of, uh, three. And my junior sister also married, give birth to four female children. The one that followed her Mary, give birth to female, female children, all of them. Mm. And it comes to the stage that the husband of that, my junior sister, the one that followed me direct, became angry. They have problem within my sister. They begin to quarrel. To the extent that the man says that even me, as a choosing, that I don't have a male child. So they called me and tell me what is going on. And they said they want to go to Oka to bring man of God who will do family deliverance for them. I told them that whatever prayer that God did not answer and the Lord chooses, forget about it. Mm. Mm. They should have patience that God will do it. Mm. When I come back at December that year, I gather all of them. We prayed together before I went to Mbidi Crusade. That same year, my wife was pregnant. And I told them that my wife is pregnant and God is going to break that yoke hey! with her. And as my wife keep put to bed, he put to bed a bouncing baby boy. Power! Rejoice and clap unto God. Thank you, Father. Thank you, God of Chosen. And as I'm talking to you now, all of them, God has break that yoke in their life. Hmm. All of them, some of them have two now. Hey! Two boys. Two boys. Power! Some have one, some have two. All of them that married. Hey! That yoke, God of Chosen, remove that shame. Hey! In my family. Wow! Clap unto God. Generational yoke. Broken. And that's what you get in this program. Thank you, Father. Choosing, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. And I still want to thank this God of choosing. When I travel at the Easter time this year, I travel with my family. We went back to village. I'm from Anambra State. So I dropped them that day. The next day, I returned back to Abba. Next thing, my wife called me that they kidnapped a boy that is living with me. So I become surprised, but I was not afraid because I know that God of choosing has never failed. I told him that he will come back. So for God, as God may have it, that, that same day, the boy said that uh, as he was telling me what happened to him that day, he said, after they dropped him in their camp, those kidnappers, they went away. When they come back, they come to ask him phone number, who they will call. And he remember that he's a choosing. Hmm. He he's make a declaration. He said, I am a choosing. I am a choosing. I am a choosing. You kidnappers, who are you? 
Where is the God of my pastor power? And he said, the angel of our pastor appeared hey! in that camp. Power! Hey, hey! As the angel appeared, an angel told him, follow me. Immediately, in the presence of those kidnappers there, all of them begin to have problems within themselves. And their leader come out and begin to quarrel. Say, who brought this boy here? That they should open gates for the boy. Hey, let them release the, that boy. That is how they open the gate and throw him away. Hey, clap on to God that appreciate him. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Father. Jesus, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. And I still want to return all the glory to this God, God of choosing, who blessed me with a truck, Tifa truck, Mercedes truck, and also a Mercedes Jeep that this God has given to me. I return all the glory, all the honor, adoration unto His holy name. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. At this juncture, I want to pray for my daddy in the Lord. I pray that this God who has called him hmm. will never disappoint him. Amen. I pray that he will never stop his ministry halfway. Amen. And I pray that at the end of his life, that God will grant him heaven at last. Amen. And also all the chosen worldwide. I also pray heaven at last for every one of us, even me and my family. I pray for heaven at last in Jesus' name. Amen. If you are coming new, I want to advise you, stay put. Our Jew used to say, he said, continuation brings freedom. Correct. As you continue, God of choosing will visit you in Jesus' name. Amen. I'm sure that those your family people, they believe you now. Because yes. you told them that there's nothing God of choosing cannot do. Yes. And they now they believe in God of choosing. They now believe in God of choosing. Yes. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Please take note and don't miss this armor, this instrument, this power. Wherever you go and there is danger, you heard him say the brother was kidnapped and when he realized he's a chosen, he declared he's a chosen traitor and said, the God of my pastor, where are you? And then the angel of our pastor appeared. And that was how confusion came and the never threw him away. Don't joke with this instrument and power. You will also testify in the face of terrible danger in Jesus' name. 